Hello traders and welcome to another video review. <coughs> Today is Monday the 14th of the, uh, June 2021. Let's take a look at the Forex candle. Not many things are going to be released uh, over the uh, London and New York session. Some data had been released already, like industrial production from Japan. That was actually better than expected. 2.9% uh, versus 2.5%. <coughs> the producer price uh, the producer input prices from uh, Switzerland had been better than expected, 0.8% versus 0.5% and better than uh, the last reading of 07 We are waiting for the industrial production data from the Eurozone, manufacturing shipments during the New York session from Canada and the leading indicators from the UK. So the uh, calendar doesn't look uh, very uh, uh, very busy today so let's just do the m review of the major paths on the forex market and major cryptocurrencies euro dollar is right now breaking lower and made a new lower low after the failure to break back above 1.22 it all started after this short-term trend line had been violated last week since then there was attempt to break the 1.22 it failed as you can see we got the shooting star candle here and then we have a move to the downside right now this is 1.42 percent move down which means this is the biggest correction biggest move down during the uh, wave up that had started on uh, the first of the april 2000 end. Uh, 21 so this might be a beginning of a new uh, uh, cycle to the now side what are we targeting on the euro dollar we are targeting the level of 1993 uh, or 1952 this is the first target on the uh, for the bears as you can see the RSI is already up below the 50 level right now the the lowest um, level was 44 points which is of course uh, below the neutral level which means the market sentiment is now negative and bears are in full control of this market what is going on on the british pound another major as you can see the british pound has failed um, to break above the level of 1.40 to 41 the highs of the beginning of the i mean at the end of the february uh, 2021 uh, it's been consolidating for at least uh, three weeks now it's fourth week of the consolidation around this level it's a tight con consolidation between 1.4073 1.4241 uh, so please notice that um, if we break below 1.40.73 then the next target is the rather key technical support between 1.40.1.4017 uh, 1.40 and the, uh, if we break below this technical support we are out of this uh, up, uh, uh, up channel which means of course this is a signature of a uh, uh, corrective pullback uh, coming harder than uh, you might uh, expect so the next target is 1.3922 of course as you can see we got our um, blue arrow here which means 1.4241 is still the, uh, the key technical resistance so please keep an eye on this level because it we might uh, we might see uh, this uh, this level uh, never be tested again so anytime we want to uh, the, the bulls want to test this level they are being capped but it's still the key technical resistance for the uh, British pound what is going on in gold gold is going down uh, right now we are uh, approaching the level of uh, 1854 which is the overbalance level because as you can see this is the biggest correction during this up move here 3.15 uh, percent so right now we are approaching this uh, this level we broke below the technical support at 1.1865 so the gold is going lower towards 1.1848 this is the next technical support of course it's, it's it's 
it is very close to this blue trend line as well maybe just around the level of one point uh, 1,836 uh, so if we break 1,848 this is the next target and it will be not really a welcome sign for bulls if the, the daily candle maybe today maybe tomorrow close below first 1 uh, 1,848 or 1,800 and around uh, let's say 50, 35, 38 dollars okay because that would mean we are definitely entering a, a corrective cycle and the uh, rsi confirms this because the rsi is already uh, below the level of 50 right now the current reading is 47 uh, points so any breakout below 1848 1838 means that we are definitely entering the bearish territory and we are heading towards the next uh, technical supports on gold so this is a much welcome pullback and uh, the last thing of course please notice we are basically out of this channel right now so that's another another um clue that tells us the bearish cycle is coming correction is coming to gold market so the last one is of course bitcoin what is going on on bitcoin at the beginning of the trading week we got this period of the consolidation on the bitcoin uh, the market attempted to uh, to make a new low uh, below the level of twenty nine thousand seven hundred and one dollar made on the 19th of the may 2021 but it failed because the low was made at thirty thousand nine hundred and eighty one since then we are slowly going up and that uh, this this pattern here this consolidation pattern looks a little bit uh, like a um triangle pattern so it means that we might be uh, seeing some sort of the breakout uh, to the downside but if there is no breakout to the downside and the market is above uh, is above the level of 40000 and then above 41893 or 43000 Five, uh, $43,053 then this idea of a triangle in the um, in the Bitcoin of course is abandoned and this ABC corrective pattern had been completed then uh, this is very very important thing because the next technical typ typically technical uh, thing would be a breakout above the trend line or even a typical breakout above the level of uh, Fibonacci level so uh, we can just basically put some Fibonacci levels here but we will wait first on the on the uh, $43,000 uh, technical resistance uh, uh, to be hit if it ever be of course hit so this is our key technical resistance and uh, this is of course the technical support the the, the low uh, of the way free and the level of uh, technically twenty eight thousand nine hundred and sixty four dollars so maybe after this uh, kind of a you know longer period of the consolidation the bitcoin is right now making some move maybe it, it, it will break to the upside or to the downside even this week so please keep an eye definitely please keep an eye on bitcoin uh, and to see how this market wants to be played out during the uh, training week so that's everything uh, for today uh, from me thank you very much for watching this analysis and i hope i see you guys tomorrow bye bye